All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Uh, Pac-Man Lesson 2, Control and Control, and Animation is what we are learning. All right, let's keep plugging away. All right, you guys know the drill. And all right, so here's where I got this stuff from. So you can go there and, and uh, follow him, or you can follow me right here. I suggest you follow me because I've got the notes. Uh, all right, so we're going to add a goats class. So to go project add class. Oh, not items.cs. I should say ghost.cs. So we're going to add the ghost class. This is a class that will allow us to make ghost objects. Okay, so I can show you how to do that. And then copy the whole using block from Pac-Man to the ghost. All right, so basically, I guess I'll show you. So what you're going to do is something a little bit like this. So you're going to go project, and you're going to add class, and it's going to be called ghost.class. So it's going to look like that, ghost or ghosts.class, either way, ghost.class, okay? And then uh, you're going to go to the Pac-Man because the most similar thing, so so the ghosts is our first actual object that's going to go be put in the world, and our Pac-Man actually gets put in the world. So we're going to go up here, and we're going to copy the using statements. So we're going to right-click and copy those using statements, and then we're going to go to ghosts, and we're going to paste those same using statements in here. Okay, all right. So let's keep. Let's go see what's next on the list. All right, add this code to the ghost. Okay, so uh, add this code to it, and here's our constructor. Um, and we're going to ask you some stuff about that later. Okay, what does OBJ do? Okay, so when you say class ghost semicolon OBJ, what does that do? And what is this constructor for? So here's this whole thing is a constructor. What is a constructor for? What does it do? And what do you call the vector two pause part? And what is it for? So right here, vector two pause. What does it do? What is it for? What is it called? Okay. Okay. So then add this code to the public variables in items. So we're going from the ghost to items.cs. All right. And basically, what does this line do? So tell me what public static ghost blinky does and what does a public static keyword do so what does public static do okay so basically you should have something a little bit like this okay so we just messed around with ghosts okay and then you're gonna go to items so you have ghosts and you have here's your constructor okay so we did this okay and so then you're gonna go to uh, items and you're going to add the stuff for Blinky, Pinky, Inky, and Clyde. Okay. Okay. So add the textures for each of the ghosts. All right. You're going to have to find. You're going to have to find the textures for the ghosts, and right-click the sprites folder and add existing items. So get these pictures, put them somewhere, and then right-click and add an item. So what that's going to look like is this. You're gonna come over here and make you're gonna go right click on sprites, you're gonna say add existing item, and then you're gonna add all of them so it should look a little bit something like this. So you already have your Pac-Man, okay? Okay, so add this code to initialize to the initialize method in items.cs. Okay, so this will be where you actually uh, so you add this to the object list. So you add Blinky, Pinky, Inky, and Clyde to the objects list. And then answer this question, what does this code specifically do? And the answer is not, this code by itself does not just add the ghosts to the world, but what does it do instead? So kind of work, work through it. What does this code do? And then also add this comment. Add Pac-Man to the objects list, so the Pac-Man is top when drawing, so it should look something like this. So it should add, look like this now, okay? Okay, save and debug. So file save will save all your files and classes start debugging by hitting F5. Um, you should see a cornflower blue screen with a Pac-Man and some ghosts, okay? That's the goal for this time. And there's no quiz as of yet. Okay, good.